So school is out for many of you parents. You know how hard it is to keep those kids busy and off of technology away from those screens. Well, one way to keep them busy and prevent that dreaded brain drain, that is yeah. a phrase none of us want to be right. labeled with, <laughs> is by reading. Yeah, I mean, reading, my goodness, it improves so much. The statistics show uh, for your just mental, you know, fitness, right? Trying to stay sharp on top of things. So, Tram Mai, she has more on Maricopa County's summer reading program, and there are some really great incentives this year that are coming with it. Now that summer's here, I like reading new books. There's something for everyone. Adventure books like gods and like Greek gods like Percy Jackson. At the library. We can look at the pictures and you can, you can talk about it. Maricopa County is launching its annual summer reading program at 65 libraries. It's a really fun and exciting program. Samantha Mears is with the county's library district. It's one of the biggest reasons we do this program is to help kids not ha experience that learning loss that, that, that can happen in between school years and the summertime. And the Wheeler kids have been doing this ever since they can remember. I like mystery and adventure. I also really like graphic novels. Mm -hmm. And Bennett, what do you like? I li really like to read the Henry, uh, Henry Huckleback books. This year's theme is all together now, exploring stories of unity, kindness, and community. And it's super easy to sign up for the program. Just log on to maricopacountyreads.org and start racking up the points. A one minute read equals one point, but you can also earn points by attending library events. You can go looking for secret codes around the community that you can enter into the dashboard. It's not just for young readers. This will be Nico's first time signing up, and he's just two. We come to the library all the time, and one day we walked in and they had their giant, um, like a canopy almost in here of just like summer reading game. We have a game board for pre-readers. Lee Franklin with Phoenix Public Library says there's even a contest for teens and adults. Yes, we want all ages. We want everybody reading. Yeah, 20 minutes a day makes, um, makes almost all of life better. Not only is reading great for the kids, but there's also some amazing prizes that they're gonna love. We get like coupons to like our favorite restaurants. 500 points, 750 and 1,000 points, you win prizes. Um, you win things like free food coupons from Peter Piper Pizza, Raising Canes. You can win tickets to a Phoenix Mercury basketball game, a state parks pass, and of course, my favorite prize is the free book. Uh, over 120 titles you can choose from from all ages. Our grand prize, which everybody's really excited about this year for our pre-readers and our little ones, are gigantic squishmallows. What's been your favorite prize? Do you remember? Peter Piper pizza. So take it from the Wheelers, who look forward to the reading program every year. It's really fun. It's something that you can do so you're not bored all summer. Yeah, and then rack up the points and then enjoy the free food a little bit later. By the way, Tram's twins, they've been doing this for several summers now. This year, Tram signed up to do it too. Now there's an extra treat for all of you 12 News viewers. Just enter the special code. Tram loves to read, which is a tr true statement. Yes. You'll earn extra points towards your reading goal. And you can get all the information you need at a link on our website that's 12news.com. I know for me growing up, the library was always a place where you could explore and find adventure. And yeah. I just love that they're getting in on it at a young age. Yeah, we say you live so many lives when you read books, right?